Okay, so hello everyone out there, so dear Nook. Um, I've got another really, really short review for you because it's really not uh, that many pages, but I absolutely love Hello Kitty and I'm really enjoying doing these books on my ASMR channel. Um, so I thought that once I read them that I would review them on my Obsidian Nook channel in my normal voice. Um, I've literally just finished this one. It is so, so early to be doing this review. Um, bearing in mind it's Halloween themed, but it's just because I'm such a slow reader, I can't get the content out, like, quick enough. Um, so basically I'm trying to whenever I read these books and I have a good day then I'm doing these reviews but this is the Halloween edition uh review as I say it's super super early um just because I've finished it for the other channel and obviously it's not my copy it's a library's copy so it's got to go back so I kind of um I'm just doing it now and even if I did want to private this video um I haven't uploaded anything on the Obsidian Nook for nearly a week now, so I'm just going to put it up anyway and just hope for the best and hopefully if you guys want a Halloween read, um, then I highly recommend this book. This is book number 13 in the Halloween, uh, Halloween, <laughs> in the Hello Kitty and Friends series. So this is the Halloween parade and this is such a cute, adorable, like, cover absolutely love it love all the little um halloween themes and on the back and on the spine we also get really cute little pictures in each book so like we have some balloons that are themed this is basically around a parade one um so yeah if you want a short read and you love hello kitty i can't recommend this series enough there's their costumes you'll definitely enjoy it and get for it and it's a fun little read too so it's nice and kind of fluffy and light as well so um so yeah so obviously we have all the the books um in the front there's obviously christmas editions to come they'll be coming early as well um but on the in page <coughs> sorry we have all of the characters but in their costumes as well so we have like Hello Kitty's a cat, uh, Tammy's a witch, Dear Daniel's like a ghost. Um, so let me just give you a close-up of that page. So in this story again, Hello Kitty is really light and fluffy, but there's always a heartwarming story to be told. And obviously it's friendships that are important, that you're always uh, there for one another and stuff like that. So I kind of like that because that's short and sweet. Um, I want to add that this one had a bad review on Goodreads because of a, someone who read it who's autistic and I kind of understand where they're, where they're coming from but being autistic myself I, just, I really love this book <laughs> it was just such a cute little way but um, I'll read you the back so come and join Hello Kitty and friends Hello Kitty is super excited about the Halloween parade. She has some new friends to help her organise it, but what happens when she needs some help from her old friends too? So in this one, we're focusing on Hello Kitty who wants to set up a parade for everyone in her town or local village. I'm not sure what it's called. Um, so yeah, but dear Daniel is, he's in the book, but he's not, He's on holiday with his dad for like two weeks during this parade happening. So Hello Kitty, Tammy and I think it's Fifi. Yeah. So Hello Kitty, Tammy and Fifi decide that dear Daniel writes a letter to them saying that how he's in like the Amazon kind of jungle and that he would write to them again and that he's having a really nice little holiday and a nice time. So uh, I just want to add, I've got all this glitter on just because I've done a glitter kind of makeup look for us. And oh, that's why I'm really like glittery. Um, yeah, so <laughs> just a side note. Um, so yeah, with this, they kind of, the three girls decide that they're going to send him a letter and they're going to make him a bracelet as well, which is really sweet, which Tammy and Fifi does sort out and sends it um on behalf of Hello Kitty because she's so busy with sorting out the parade, getting stuff together. 
she meets Susie and Claudia who kind of become her friends but they're not kind of best friends um, so they need a band but then Claudia completely forgets to sort out a band and she rings Hello Kitty to get her to come over and sort it out this is where it kind of got me a little bit um, because Hello Kitty and Tammy are like best friends and Tammy's having a birthday bowling party and Hello Kitty kind of explains to her mum that she needs to go to Claudia's because there's like this emergency where they their band is backed out and that they need to now find another one and that's something that they wanted a band called Fizzy Pops that they couldn't get because apparently they're too famous so they never ended up getting a band anyway but then Hello Kitty literally forgot Tammy's birthday and I'm sure with all the stress and that it's reasonable. She does make it up to Tammy so she gets Tammy a kind of glittery stationery set with all of her change in her piggy, piggy bank which is really kind. Uh, she also organises a birthday cake a week later at the parade for Tammy and for everyone to sing happy birthday to make up for it because Hello Kitty does feel very guilty and she does feel remorseful about um, forgetting her birthday and obviously not only forgetting but not ringing and turning up to the birthday party because she was so wrapped up in with Claudia and Susie um, but she goes around to Claudia's house and they kind of have their nails and they kind of do their hair and Hello Kitty's a bit like well hang on a minute I thought there was an emergency with the band like should we be doing this because I was like you're kind of missing your best friend's birthday party for this, do you know what I mean? So anyway, they kind of all sort it out and as I say, she makes it up to Tammy in the end and then they, with each book, they come up with like a new motto for like friends and that. So it is a sweet little talk and then they also have a parade where they all show off their Halloween costumes and again, Hello Kitty did not know what she wanted to go out sorry go as again but she um tammy went as a witch and then hello kitty goes as a black kitty dressed up so in the end she has it all figured out um so they all do so again it's about knowing who your friends are who's going to be there for you because obviously tammy and fifi are always going to be there for hello kitty because they're best friends and obviously you know as i say it all works out it's a lovely little fluffy read and i absolutely loved this one and I enjoyed it um it only took me three sittings to get through this one because obviously I film it for the a for the other channel the ASMR relaxation channel uh petal ASMR if you're interested I'd really 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 sub ugh, would really recommend if you could go and check it out and give all the support and especially this channel support as I'm trying to build up like my dream kind of book channel and I do gaming videos as well but it depends what type of gaming videos because I'm not there's only certain games that I play and that I can enjoy and that I can actually do independently on my own um I've only just just figured out <laughs> after my other half shoe me how to play battlefield I only just now got that figured out so but yeah so yeah it took me three seconds to get through this one but bearing in mind if you're not doing it for a video and you're just reading it for leisure then you'll get through this probably within an hour or two um depending on your read and speed and everything and how fast you can read so yeah i highly if you definitely love the hello kitty series um and you want something that's light fluffy but not too much into it then i highly recommend this series if you want something to read for halloween this is the perfect little book and again if you don't want anything too uh, massive in a book because as I say this does have really nice uh, little pictures as you go through. I'm trying to find ones that, um, so like this is the Halloween band thing that they had set up. Um, so yeah, so throughout the book you have like really nice uh, pit illustrations and pictures. Um, so yeah, as I say. This is the perfect little read and please subscribe, uh, like and support this because obviously for all these who interact it helps the channel kind of move and grow a little bit. So thank you very much and I do have uh, I do have more Hello Kitty books to review on the way. I also have the Life is Strange comics that I want to do but I'm doing You're So Dead at the moment which that review will be coming soon and then 
I do have another one called Let's Play Murderer, which is another library copy. So I need to get through the library copies first before I can then move on to my Life is Strange comics and then everything else I have to read. So yeah, thank you so much for watching.